Our next speaker is Laura Wilson. Yes, hi. hi, thank you. I want to say that my only goal in being here is to preserve the peace, quiet, and enjoyment of the neighborhood in which I live in. I've lived in this beautiful neighborhood for 13 years, and right now our neighborhood is basically being destroyed. Um, loose, I live in a supposedly protected loose neighborhood, and um, it says the highest priority is, uh, of the community is to preserve these existing neighborhoods and the character of them. The addition of this, what I consider to be illegal conversion of a hotel in my neighborhood is basically eroding the character of the neighborhood that I live in. Um, in uh, it says in our own municipal codes that in order for a hotel to exist in that area, it had to exist before to, to, uh, 1995, and it did not. And it did not pay any taxes until 2000, no transient taxes until 2000 for that hotel. How can a hotel exist if it didn't pay any taxes? Number one, when it was built in 1927, it was built as a residential unit. It did not um, call itself commercial at all. It was sold over and over again as a multi-residential property. And also the zoning for that property has never, ever been commercial. It's always been residential. How could it be a hotel now? It does not make sense. Also, in their 2003 application to become a historical landmark, they asserted over and over again that they were primarily residential. Residential, residential. And it says in our own municipal codes that you cannot convert any additional space and, to, and convert it into hotel rooms. The city attorney, I don't know who gave you guys advice, but it was all done behind closed doors because I went back and tried to find it, and all I find is closed door meeting, closed door meeting, closed door meeting. Then I see a meeting on, online where you vote on it, but there's no real ideas of how you voted on it and how you came to this decision. The decision was a bad one. I think you made it with the intent to save the um, residents that live there, but it was a bad decision because you destroyed okay. the neighborhood. Okay, thank you, Ms. Wilson.